Hey guys, Bubble Pop Kids here. I hope you're in the mood for some sweet treats. We got a candy bonanza right now. Hey you little bubble teens, welcome back to my table. Not my squishy table today, it's like my little candy lab. I went candy shopping a couple days ago. I got tons of new ones, crazy ones, some Japanese candies. I got lots of gummies. I even have, look at these, Tabasco. Jelly Belly, ooh, they are gonna be spicy. There's so much sugar going on here. We got gummies, we got surprise eggs, we have little lollipops, these are so adorable. And probably the best thing on the table, a little bubblegum crane game. Look how cute. It is the gum catcher. The gum catcher, let's try now. Oh yeah. Let me just count these babies up and see what we're working with here. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven different sweet treats. Let's kick off the bonanza now. Bubble, take me to Sugar Town. Sugar Town. Yeah. Sweetie Pies, we are kicking off the bonanza, and I guess we're kicking off Memorial Day weekend with this little packet here. To tell you the truth, I don't know what it says but I think it's some kind of gummy. It's some kind of Japanese gummy candies. And my friend Colleen got these for me. She said they're called gummy stickers. They almost look like little window clings, but they are edible. This is the cutest thing ever. Look at her. Shoopin' it. Oh, this has got to be Sailor Moon Sister or something like that. She's so pretty. And judging by the looks of the package, there's a little grape, so maybe these are like grape flavor. They kind of look purple. Let's see. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> they kind of do look like stickers. They look like these puffy stickers. And I apologize, my voice is going in and out. I have a tiny little cold going on. Ooh. So cool, look at that. Window cling, or like a sticker jelly, not food. So I popped open the package and we get one, two, three, four different little gummy stickers. That is exactly what they look like. They're kind of sticky and there's little pictures on them. Doesn't look like the most appetizing, but it smells so good. Woo! It's so strong, almost like a fresh grapefruit juice. Let me try. I have to tell you, these are probably the yummiest fruit gummy candy snack I think I've ever had. They have almost a plasticky, rubbery texture. It's got a weird texture, but the taste, oh, so, so good. Very sweet, very fresh. And let's take a look at these ones. So, so cute, look at that. I wish they had them in like different colors. Got two little ones. Hmm, oh, looks like a little kitty. They're stretchy too. They're almost like window clings. Look at this little baby one, Bubba. It looks like a little sticker. Look at that. Let me eat it. So good. That Bubba, that is definitely like Sailor Moon Sister. Look at the face. So pretty. So that was that. I ate most of it for little sticker jellies. These were delish. I think Colleen, she told me she got these for like 50 cents in Japan. Probably you could find them online or at Amazon or something like that. But Loved them. Let's move along. Up next on my candy table, I got some Tsum Tsum, a little Tsum Tsum chocolate surprise egg. I don't think I've opened a surprise egg in so long, and this is so cute. It's actually from Tokyo. I can't really read it, but I'm sure there's gonna be a little toy and some chocolate. Pop it open. Uh oh, we better get Buzz Lightyear, or I'm gonna be super mad at you. Open it. Ooh, that's cute. Inside of this colorful little box, ooh, I love this box. I don't know why it's so cute. We get this little wrapper, almost looks like wrapping paper. Something is inside for sure. Let's see, ooh, and it's not broken. Sometimes when I get these, they are smashed up. This is fully intact and looks delish. Surprise toy. I can't believe it. The egg was intact. Dark chocolate, white chocolate, and pink capsule. It is our lucky day today. <laughs> Ooh. We got chip and dip. 
everybody, this was a surprise. You guys, my mind is feeling me right now. Who is this? Is it Thumper from Bambi? I recognize her, but I don't remember. If you know who this is, leave me a comment. But this is crazy, because it's actually like a full-size Tsum Tsum. It is the real deal. Little ears pop off. I love it. It's got a little stand. Look at this. It is like winking at you. It is so adorable with the cotton tail. And wasn't Thumper a boy? I think it's a girl. Yes! We got a two for one sale, little candy, little toy, and here is the list. I cannot believe there are like 14 to collect. So, so cute. And they have Alice in Wonderland. Who is that? It's like a little baby. Monsters Inc. These are really cool. I gotta get more of these. Colleen got this in Tokyo. Maybe she'll go back and get me a few more. Love it. So we had a little gummy, a little chocolate, and now some slush puppy. Double squeeze. Yeah, slush puppy, double squeeze, candy. Two flavors in one. Crazy. This one looks good. I have had slush puppy candies before, but never a double squeeze. This almost looks like an icy from like 7-Eleven, and it's heavy and it's super big. I see some green, I see some blue. It almost looks like slime or some kind of ooze. We got two flavors going on in this little cup. We got some watermelon and blueberry. Let's try this. Come on, Bubba. It is time to open up the slush puppy cup. Open it. Ooh, what's going on? Hmm, little confused right now. What is this? What is this thing? It almost looks like some toothpaste. I pop this little piece off. Maybe you just squeeze it. Whoa, you! <laughs> that's slushy, bubble that's too slushy for me! Ugh, gross! This thing, ugh, you guys, I love candy, but I don't like it. It is so, so gross. First of all, I don't like the texture. It's got like these little gritty pieces of like sugar in there. It feels almost like sand. Ugh, feels like toothpaste. Kinda looks like toothpaste. Just don't like it. I don't like anything about that. It's not too tasty. Oh, it's literally taste like you got a tube of old toothpaste and put sugar and like gross stuff inside. Ugh. Look at this. Look at this. Just ain't right. That's not right. That's not candy bubble. That is like sugar ooze. No way. So guys, judging by my reaction, I think you know I don't like it. I'm never gonna eat this. It is gross. Everything about it is gross. I think the little container's kinda cute. But no slush puppies for me, please. No way. But guess what, Bubba? It's a double no for the double squeeze. No way. We cannot eat this. Ever. Cause it destroyed your table. Look how sticky it is. Sweetie Pies, I cannot believe it. We are on to candy number four. And it is a gum catching machine. Almost like one of those little UFO catchers. Nice to meet you, Bubba. I'm a gum catcher. A gum catcher. Bubba, the gum catcher is crazy. Look at him. He's crazy. I think we have to pop the top. I literally do not know how this is gonna work. I've never seen one before. It is just too, too much. Woo! We got seven gumballs to try to catch. I don't even know where they pop out of. I think this. Nice colors, I love them. Pop them in here. Oh, just like throw them on to the gum catcher board. That's what I'm calling it. The little gum catcher board. I'll put some of these on here. I don't know if this is where they go. They're just kind of floating around. And this little thing is supposed to pop down. Let's try this thing. It looks kind of fun. I think we could have had a few more gumballs though. Let's see. Let me take a little look. See, it looks like we got a bunch of buttons going on. So this one here, I think it moves it left and right. Look at that little gumball. moves it left and right, and these, ooh, this is where it grabs it. Yikes. Doesn't look too simple. Ah! Uh oh, this thing is like taste complicated. It is totally complicated. I think it's impossible. That little gumball guy is not catching anything. For real. Ah. It 
actually worked. You guys, this thing was so much chaos, but it came out. We got a blue one. It's actually fun. I don't know how it works. Just keep going. Ooh. Almost got it. Oh, this is like a little, it's like a little lobster claw. Uh, this is so much more complicated than a lobster claw that you don't even know. It is so hard, but we have to do it. Ooh, got it, got it. Whoa, whoa, got it, got it. Whoa, got it. All right, I don't even know if these are gumballs. Maybe they're like m and um, Delicious, these sweetie little gumballs. They're so weird. They almost taste like Starburst, like little Starburst candies. I could literally play this all day. It's kind of hard, but once you get it, ooh, I got it. Look at that. It's so much fun. Ooh. The ice bubble, you got the lemon, the lemon gumball. You're the best. I caught all of them. Look at all these cute little colors. There is one. I gotta get it. It's gonna drive me crazy. Yes. After playing with this thing, the best candy on the planet. I mean, these are yummy. This is the coolest little game. I cleared it. There's nothing left. Amazing. So, I hope you're in the mood for some muddy bears. Because even if you're not, you're eating them. Right now. If you guys like gummy bears and chocolate, you're in luck because we got a combo going on here. These are milk chocolate covered gummy bears. This is the cutest little box ever. And when I saw this, I thought it was like honey dripping on his head, but it's chocolate. And we got apple, pineapple, and strawberry. Let's open it. Yeah, Bubba, let's open up the muddy bears. Muddy bears, so fun to say. Oh, got this looks a little funny. It kind of looks like little hamster poops. Very colorful box. But these look like some kind of weird things. I don't know. Let's see. They do not look appetizing. Ew, they don't look good. You know what they look like? Chocolate covered bugs or something like that. Whew, but the smell is taking me over. It's so, so chocolatey. And they are kind of cute. Look at that. Mmm. Green apple. Try and get a pineapple. It's like a clear one. Let's see. Ooh, twins. Mm -hmm. I tried the strawberry. Oh, even better. Sorry to chew in your ears, guys. These are so, so chewy. They are so good. I think I picked this up at like CVS. It was like a dollar. And probably the tastiest candies so far. They are so good. Such a weird combo, like chocolate on gummy, but it works. It's really good. We got tons of them. Love these. So, the chocolate and gummy combination rocks. You don't even know about that. It rocks. Tabasco, Bubba. Get ready for Tabasco. You're so scared of it. Oh no, Bubba, look. You got some Tabasco on your table. It's gonna burn your tongue. No, <laughs> I was actually avoiding this one. Jelly Belly Tabasco. Ew, this is like hot sauce flavored jelly beans. I mean, I don't know what to think about that gonna burn. I don't know, it's gonna be so spicy. Let's test them. I'm just gonna taste one. I'm such a chicken. Oh, please, don't be such a baby. It's not like it's a jalapeno, it's Tabasco. Ugh, why did they even make this Tabasco jelly beans? I mean, I don't see what they have in common. Woo! Here goes, oh, I'm so scared. They look spicy, woo! Look like little chili peppers. is the weirdest person in the universe. Slack, Sarah, Slack. Weird. These things are kind of weird, you guys. When you first put them in your mouth, you taste nothing. There's like no flavor until you start chomping down on it and whew, that spicy pepper, almost like a crushed top pepper, comes burn it. It just burned me up. I don't like them. If you love extreme spicy things or you like cinnamon candies, I think you would like these, but I don't. Ooh, Tabasco, no good. Oh, like Tabasco is bad, but Jelly Belly Tabasco is like maximum bad. Ugh. My tongue is on fire from those little jellies, but we are moving on to some other little jelly gummies. But they are sugared cupcake and 
penguins. As soon as I saw these, I had to get them. Not only because they look like the cutest little gummies ever, look at those little cupcakes and penguins, but these boxes, look at these little plastic boxes. And another crazy thing, the penguins are peachy flavor. So weird. I tried so many different gummy candies like frogs, little smurfs, you name it, but I don't think I've ever seen penguins. These are so adorable. I love this. It is the snack snob. Ooh, what is that? <laughs> Let's try them. They are so cute. Are you scared, Bob? I lost my happy feet. All. These are so cute. I guess they're just like a black and white color, but more than how cute they are is a smell. Whew. It smells like a peach sorbet. It smells like a fresh peach. Like these smell so, so good. You would think that they would be like a licorice flavor or something. Let's try. Mm, peach City Bubble. This is Peach City like. I can taste the nectar. Well, that was the first, my little gummy penguins. Oh, love those things. And we got the sugared cupcake. Now, I think that is the scent or the flavor. They are too, too cute. Look at that little cuppy cake. Oh, I don't know which ones are cuter. You guys, look at these. It looks like they're in two different colors. We get like a little yellow, white, and red and purple, white, and red. They look like gumdrops. Sweet, delicious. These are creamy. Now, these ones here are kind of like smooth and fruity. These ones are creamy. They almost taste like ice cream. They have like a vanilla taste. And I guess they do taste like a cupcake, like a vanilla frosting. They are just so, so cute. And these ones have like sugar on them. Little gumdrop cupcakes. And that right there is a lot of gummies. I got so much gummy going on the table right now. I have to just kind of sort these out and I'm gonna put them in a candy jar. Cannot waste these babies. So good. Yeah, we finally got some lollies. Actually, the first lollipops of the Bonanza today, and they are so, so cute. Literally the cutest little things. Tamika, look at them. They're like little cars and trucks. Looks like Matchbox. Oh, read the message. Tamika, let's build Tamika World. Like, what does that mean? And this one little strand here, we get one, two, three, four, five. Different mollies, different kinds of trucks. Look at that little sports car. I don't know how cute they could have made this. It's like so adorable. And they tear off. Look at that. Yummy. So funny. Look, they made like a little car sheep. Nothing too special, just like a regular orange lolly. But more than the taste, it's actually super sweet. Are these little packages? Like, I can't get over it. Love them. Can you believe it, Bubble? We reached the final two. Final two candies. Which one would you like? We got two left and they are super cute. Look at this little bag. I don't even know what it is. It's like a little bunny with puzzle pieces. That is so cute. And we get a bottle. Let's open this one. Ooh, it's a crown bottle. So cool. Crown bottle. another candy compliments of my friend Colleen. She brought it back from Tokyo and it is so cute. Look at that. It's got a little bottle opener. Unreal. Look at that. Uh, maybe this way. How do you do this thing? There. That is so cool. Ooh. I'm thinking these are chocolate. They're so, so bright. Mmm. Like M&M's. Crunchy. Oh, these literally don't even look like candies. They look like Beatles. You know those Beatles things? Yeah. Delicious, like these little crunchy candy coated chocolates. Almost like M&M's, but a little bit crunchier. And you know what I was thinking, guys? When you're finished with these and this thing is empty, I could put some slime in here, like make a little slime bottle. That is just so, so cute. Look, the top goes back. Little soda bottle. Opener. 
minus two little holes here for safekeeping. Look at that. Adorable. And as used by the end of these, oh, I am sugared out. I am hyper. I'm like jumping. I tried all of these things, and there is the final one. Looks like puzzle candy. Crazy. Crazy. Oh, can you read any of this? Because I can't. But it looks like bunny puzzles with chocolate and candy. Let's see what this thing is. Normally I could tell what something is. This one, I'm a little confused. I don't know if it's like sweet candies or chocolates. Or maybe a little bit of both. Ooh, definitely a little bit of both. Oh, you guys, these are so amazing. They are little tiny puzzle pieces. I can't tell if they're chocolate. Mmm. Actually, you know what they are? They're like little marshmallows. Whoa, <laughs> these are so good. Mmm, I have tasted a couple. I can't even tell what they are. They're kind of like, they're definitely not chocolate. And they're not gummies. They're harder than marshmallow. But they are so good. They're creamy. They taste like ice cream. These are definitely like ice cream flavor. Oh, these are good, but they're weird. Like little teeny puzzle piece marshmallow things. That's weird. Probably the first time I've ever tasted something and I can't pinpoint it. I don't know what this is made of. It is a cotton candy, almost like a ice cream flavor. And they snap together. Look at these little pieces. They actually, they link. That is amazing. I love them. I just don't know what they're made of. There's another bubble. They're so delicious. Like, forget about it. There you go, guys. Another candy bonanza. So many cool ones. A couple that were not so good, like the Tabasco. Ugh. And that slush puppy. So oozy and gross. If I had to pick a fave, I would definitely see this little gumball claw machine. It was so, so cute. And I'd love for you little sweetie pies to leave me a comment and let me know out of all these candies. What was your fave? We are going to have so many more fun videos coming up in the show. We're going to have squishy, slime, candy, you name it. We are Bubble Pop Kids. And if you want to subscribe to our channel, just click this big yellow bubble with the bubblegum machine and subscribe. Have a great day, you guys.